has been hot shooting from the three-point line in SEC play. Yes, it's with the layups and true road games. Pretty impressive numbers. And you can consider a lot of teams just get demolished on the road in this league. Kessens, high arching jumper is good just inside the arc. Very difficult schedule, and they perform pretty well against it, and another big opportunity for them today, and they're taking advantage so far. Edwards. Allen, good screen by Finney Smith, freed up for the three. Taylor couldn't hang on to it. Allen back the other way. Big hop step, reverse slam. Oh, is that nice? Hale on the floor. Chioza at the elbow. Too strong. Tap in by Finney Smith. Alabama did a nice job to AM. They out rebounded AM on the offensive backboards 14 to 8. That has been one of their Achilles heels this year is rebounding. Don't need to worry about rebounding if you're going to bury him like that from Shane. Comes over, knocks it away. Chioza. Leon buries the three. His 17th of the year. He's a good three point shooter. Last few shots have started to fall for Florida. Right out of the timeout, Brett Nobasahan. Point per minute pace from these two teams. That's a good way to elevate your field goal percentage right there. Just Florida holding Alabama to that point per minute pace. Only 20 in the first half. And Budo now with seven. Three seconds, Coleman. Two, pull up long three. Got it off the backboard. <laughs> a huge back basket for Alabama. That would have been a 10-0 run for Florida had that not gone down to end the half. Where will Alabama go? Riley Norris, catch, shoot, perfect. 53 to go. Want to see Alabama get it inside. Jimmy Taylor has been so effective down around the basket for the tie. This is how, if you haven't seen Alabama play, this is what they do. This is the perfect type of game that they have played all year. Keep it close. And hope to have a chance down the stretch. As Coleman knocks down his second three. That was more of the traditional three. <laughs> yeah, hit the 28-footer uh, right before the half off the glass. That one a little more pure. Justin Leon with his second three. Oh, nice pick. Kayvon Allen. Obasahan is fouled, and he'll step to the line. Oh, he's going after him. Obasahan, boy, can he hang in the air? No. Tied back up by one. Obasahan, bump, score it. Up to his game today. I think they have absolutely focused on Renton Obasahan. Attacked him when he's had the basketball. He is now 4 of 12 at the line. Hale, good catch, tied up, got it to Taylor Ooh. with a throw down. And <laughs> one. Oh, that got the entire Alabama bench up in a hurry. Jimmy Taylor has sat on the bench Ooh. for a few minutes. He has been a force in this ball game. Just in, fresh legs, and throwing it down over John Ekbunu, giving him the stare down. Jimmy Taylor giving the tide a four point edge. Allen, pull up jumper, got it. That's a good looking shot. Kayvon Allen now with nine. Oh, oh. Got to be careful here. Oh, he may have just did it. Yep. There it is. That is number five on Obasahan. You got Jimmy Taylor and Renton Obasahan sitting on the sidelines and for Alabama. And Edwards just picked up his fifth. His night is done. Wow.
Two starters gone in a matter of 10 seconds for Alabama. I don't want Riley Norris, Jimmy Taylor, or Shannon Hale getting shots. Ooh. Oh, Jimmy Taylor! <laughs> oh! Where has this come from? Tell you what, if the NCAA committee is watching Alabama, they're passing the eye test. You can wrap it up here in 11.1 seconds unless something dramatic happens. Here's Shannon Hale on the open floor, and he will pretty much seal it right there. Off the mark, rebound to Coleman, and he will send it down to Hale. That won't count. But Alabama with a huge win on the road. You got to go back to 1995, the last time they picked up a win in Gainesville, Florida.